A day-long celebration is underway for the Buffalo Philharmonic Orchestra's Joanne Folletta. She's celebrating her 20th anniversary as the BPO's conductor. 7 Eyewitness News senior reporter Eileen Buckley shows us how Folletta has generated great popularity and success for the orchestra. Joanne Valletta's anniversary celebration began with the coffee concert series at Kleinhans Music Hall. But before she picked up the baton to conduct, the mayor declared it Joanne Valletta Day in Buffalo. It's just been a, the best 20 years of my life. Valletta says the celebration is overwhelming, but was feeling a lot of Buffalo love. And it just, I feel surrounded by love, you know, and that's what Buffalo is. It's just people who love this orchestra come to our concerts, come to our morning concerts and have donuts and coffee with us. And Valletta fans are everywhere. I come uh, every year to the Friday morning classes and uh, she always has an exciting agenda and she's uh, tops. She's the tops. So we're lucky to have her. She loves us. We love her back. It's a beautiful fit and great, great chemistry. Valletta brought star power to the orchestra when she arrived 20 years ago to lead a then struggling BPO. We've come a long way. I'm very, very proud of this orchestra. They are absolutely superb. What do you see over the next decade for the BPO? Well, continued strengthening of our financial base so that these musicians can never have to worry about, about our orchestra not being there for them and the community as well. Uh, more recordings, maybe more touring, just growing artistically and growing as a family. Folletta and the orchestra are Grammy winners, but credits the leadership, board, and BPO members for its success. She received a special recorded video message from famed American music composer Danny Elfman. To say hello to the Buffalo Philharmonic, to our wonderful conductor, Joanne Folletta. You would recognize his music from Burton's films, like Edward Scissorhands. <laughs> Friday's concert was titled Danny Elfman's Violin Concerto. Along with this concert here at Kleinhans Music Hall, there will be a black tie gala tonight at Hotel Henry. Eileen Buckley, 7 Eyewitness News.